Hi everybody, welcome to this tournament preview video for the Ocean Lynx Nine Hole Cup. That will be the next live event in the game of Golf Clash, bringing you all the details here on the BK Golf Clash YouTube channel. Please give me a thumb up if you don't mind at this point and make sure to check that you are a subscriber if you haven't uh, subscribed already. Totally free to do so. Now coming up in this Nine Hole Cup, practice begin on uh, Monday the 7th of August, qualifying round begins Thursday 10th of August. We're playing a lovely mix of holes from Namhae Cliffs, Centenary Harbour and Drummore Links. And there's a modifier in play here. And I think you'll like this one. It is the tailwind only modifier. No headwinds at all on any hole. The sea breeze is in your back. Let it carry you further. And as we have had this modifier before, just worthy of reminding you that it doesn't mean that your wind arrow is going to be absolutely straight vertical every single time from T to the pin. It just means that all the angles will have a tailwind element. So you may get cross tailwind for instance but rest assured there will be no headwind at all we're going to have a look at the holes that will be used coming up very very shortly i would think this is going to be a fun one to play lovely mix of holes and of course tailwind angles means you're going to be sending it and getting some nice eagle and albatross opportunities let's have a look at all the nine holes being used right now we begin with that nice par 4 from Namhae Cliffs and of course with this modifier you are going to be looking at wanting to be either on the green or very close to the green. Beware though, there are unreachable putts if you just trickle onto the green. So either go for the uh, fairway between the rough and the green or the green itself. There is in some cases a chance for a par 4 hole in one. Then we have the par 3 from Drummore Lynx. Of course you've got your bounce over options, you've also got a rough bump, very decent chance there. And then we go to Centenary Harbour for hole three. Absolutely blastable in high tailwind for expert and master. If not, a very good chance laying up and then going for the rough bump for your albatross. Back to Namhae Cliffs we go for hole number four. A possible rough bump there for the hole in one and also a bounce up on that par three. Then we're back to Drummer Links for hole five and six. Another blast opportunity if you get a decent enough tailwind angle and of course a decent enough wind strength to roll from the rough out to the green for a wedge or a putt. But even if you don't blast it all the way over, still a very good opportunity. Same with hole six, blast it down the left-hand side over the rough for an uphill long iron or sniper for the albatross there. So those are going to be some very fun holes to play with this modifier. And the enjoyment continues on hole seven, Centenary Harbour once again. Pick the clubs with the most topspin and power. Bounce over the water and try and clear the trees. You've got a very clear shot to the pin if you roll far enough on that par four. Heading back to Drummer Links for the par three there with a very decent chance. And once again, either bouncing over or going for the rough bump. Beware of glitch roll there. There has been known to be a couple of instances where you can catch an unlucky glitch. So maybe a token or two to make sure you're going to be safe for that one. We finish up with Namhae Cliffs, very tough to get an albatross on, but obviously with the tailwind modifier, you shouldn't have any difficulty reaching the green in two. I favour the Guardian for that second shot though, has a bit more distance and the all-important backspin on that par five to round off this selection of holes. Thank you for watching this preview video for the Ocean Lynx Nine Hole Cup. Now, what can you expect on the channel? Well, if you are a YouTube channel member or a Patreon member, you will now have access, early access, to my general playthrough for the Ocean Lynx Nine Hole Cup, which features all tailwind angles. So all of the shots there will be relevant. You're not going to see any headwind there, so you will have the aggressive routes presented for you. That will be on the public channel very soon as well so keep checking for that as well as that there will be expert hole guide videos for qualifying and final round and another perk if you are a member of the channel and on patreon you now have early access to the beginning of my golf clash history series a very nostalgic look back at how the game has developed since it was launched all those years ago Thank you for watching. Good luck, everybody, in the Ocean Lynx Nine Hole Cup. Hope you do well and enjoy those fun send-it shots in the Tailwind modifier. Looking forward to seeing you all soon. Bye for now.